Welcome back. I'm Bob Kirkpatrick with today's local sports. It was a good night for Quincy High School hoops as both the girls and boys teams earned wins over Tenasca Tuesday. The girls kicked off the action in the first game of the night. Quincy fell behind early but didn't trail very long as the Lady Jacks caught fire to take a 21-18 lead at the break. Up by only three points heading into the second half of play, Quincy went on a 15-4 run midway through the third quarter to blow the game open and cruise to a 43-31 win. Lyndon Chavez led the offensive attack for the Lady Jacks with 11 points. Heidi Nielsen added 10, and Valerie Tobin finished with 9. The win improves Quincy to 1-6 and six in Caribou Trail League play and 3-9 and nine overall. Well, things look bleak for the Quincy boys team as the Tigers raced out to a 9-0 lead and were up 25-14 at intermission. But whatever Coach Peterson said to the team in the locker room to get the guys to refocus took root and the Jacks bounced back to close the gap to 48-46 with time winding down. That's when the wheels fell completely off the bus for Tenasket as two lazy fouls put Luis Zogaib at the free throw line twice in the last 30 seconds. Zogaib calmly sank all four attempts to put Quincy up 50-48 with two seconds on the clock to ice it for the two and five jacks. Quincy is back on the court tomorrow night for a home game against Waluke. The action gets started at 6 p.m. Afraid of basketball picked up wins on the road in Sela last night. The Lady Tigers find them, found themselves in a real battle with the Lady Vikings, but were able to pull out a 45-43 nail-biter to even their record at 4-4 four and four in CWAC play. Gunner Blankenship drained 20 points, Riley Pheasant added 15, and Jacob Laird hauled down 11 boards to help lead the Afraid of Boys to a decisive 68-43 win over Sela. The victory keeps the 6-2 Tigers in the thick of things as they move into a tie for second place with East Valley. East Euphrata is back on the hardwood Friday when the Tigers host Topnish. The Lady Tigers tip off at 545. The Soap Lake Eagles look to be the team to be reckoned with in Central Washington 1B South Conference boys basketball as they have put together a nine-game win streak to nail down first place in the standings. Soap Lake moved to 4-0 and in league play and 9-1 and overall with a lopsided 66-38 win at home over the Waterville Shockers last night. The Eagles are back at it Friday when they host the Intiat Tigers at 7.30. Well, be sure and tune in tomorrow night for iFiber One Sports live coverage of the Moses Lake Wenatchee Wrestling Match. The action gets underway at 7 p.m. Well, that's it for sports. We'll be right back after this.